Hey YouTube, it's Just Dad Sparkle, and today I'm going to show you how to wash your Mary and Mary hair. So when you're washing their hair, you usually want to have their eyes covered with something. I'm using toilet paper. You, uh, a lot of people use cotton balls and like uh, stick them on there, but I didn't have any right now. So today I have Allie. She's my friend's doll, and she wanted me to wash her hair. When you're washing your doll's hair, well, actually I'll tell this a little later, but you can use... Any shampoo, I'm using Garnier Frutis, Frutis, I think this is how you pronounce it. And I am also using conditioner. And so, yeah, her hair is really dry and frizzy. And we're going to make it all pretty. And this is actually also for my video, um, Allie and Marisol's Total Makeover. Well, not Total Makeover, but anyway, you can check that out. Um, and so I'm going to get started. So... Let's see, let's get out the sink a little bit. You're, you can use, you don't have to use hot water. I'm not because just it takes forever to get hot water. So, you're going to only wash the uh, ends. Do not get it on her scalp because otherwise uh, that will be bad. Okay, so just do the ends, you know. You'll know where to stop and things. I'm going to have to take this off. I'm not even getting close up there since she has longer hair. Usually you don't want to do this on short hair dolls. You definitely don't want to do it on Kit. But medium hair, I guess you could. But it's better on dolls like Josephina. You know, uh, Kaya or Kaya. With longer hair. Okay, so now you're just going to put a tiny bit of shampoo. You probably can't really see it. Just a tiny, tiny bit. Less than what you usually use. And going. She, you know, rub it throughout the hair. I really like to get the ends because, you know, that's where there's a lot of frizz. Here, I'll show you a little bit more. And, yes, as I said, only get the ends and don't try it on short hair dolls because you don't want to get it up here on the wig. If you get on up there, on, like, sort of like her scalp, uh, it'll, her wig will fall off. So, yeah, that's not good. Okay. Now I'm going to uh, wet this hand so that I can flip her over and you know, dry it so I can flip her over. Hope I don't get my camera wet because it's being so close to the faucet. Okay. Now I have little these pieces uh, which are shorter. If you want to wash these you can. You don't have to but since they're shorter and more scary that you might get. I'm just going to add a little bit of soap because I know how to like get around there with still without getting on her scalp. But then I'm just going to get this back part. Really work it in. Oh yeah. Okay, so now rinse. Okay, and dry my hand so I can flip her over. And if you get a little bit of water on her scalp, it's okay, but you just don't want to, like, drench her scalp. Anything. And I'm going to get these cut. And her hair is, like, already feeling softer and everything. Okay, now I'm going to let the water go down because if you look, it's all bubbly from, well, you can't really see. Eh, you still can't really see. Oh, but anyway, it's like, you know, bubbly from the shampoo and the water, you know. Okay, so I'm going to put the conditioner in her hair now. Dry it off my hands. And back to the picking out a shampoo, you, you don't really want it. Whoa, glad I caught it. Oh my goodness. Sorry guys, my camera just fell, and it almost fell in the water. That would not have been good. Oh my goodness, it won't stand up. Okay. It's a good thing I caught it. Okay. Uh, back to the shampoos and conditioners. You just don't want to do one where it's like extra hard, like a detangling or anything. But 
It doesn't have to be like a super duper soft one. Like this is the one I use on my hair. Okay, just put it throughout her hair. Of course, it's not going to be as bubbly since it's a conditioner. And this will just make it less frizzy, you know. Some people don't like to put conditioner. I'll do because I'm drying out my hand. Okay. Because I just think it makes her hair all soft and less frizzy. I think that's what it helps with. Okay, just getting these back little ends. Okay. Now I'm just going to let this sit for about two minutes. And I will get back to you when it's done sitting. Okay, so it's had for at least one minute. Just real quick so you know we can just work its magic and all. And I added a little bit more uh, conditioner. And so yeah, I'm going to rinse. And her hair is just feeling so, so much softer. Like it's incredible how soft it feels now. I forgot I was, it was recording for a second. So yeah, that's basically it. Now I'm going to let it dry overnight. And in the morning, um, I'm going to, you know, brush it and everything. If uh, your doll has curly hair, then in about an hour, if you're, you know, you're not about to go to bed or anything, you can put curlers in. To really define the curls of her, your doll's hair. And I actually have a video on how to curl your American doll's hair. But anyway, I'm just going to hang it over the, the side of my sink over a towel. And yeah, it'll be all soft. It's so less frizzy. Like, so, so, so less frizzy. I'm so happy. Anyway, yeah, that's how to wash your American girl doll's hair. I hope you enjoyed. And keep watching all my other videos. And rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Okay, everyone. Bye. So she is laying here. Her hair is dripping onto this towel. And I meant to say, while I was washing her hair, that um, this doll is, a, is at least six years old, um, my friend told me. And so that's why I'm washing her hair, and it was a horrible damage. And I also watched Mar washed Marisol's hair, which is old as well, and her hair was a mess. It was like, I, they put, I don't know if they put hairspray in it or something, it was really bad. And now it's like amazingly soft and stuff. So don't do this to like... Probably has to be at least three to four years old. Four um, or more would be the best. But I don't do it to like a brand new doll or something because cherish her hair as it is. Um, so yeah, only wash the hair if it gets really bad. So anyway, yeah, I just wanted to tell you that. And thanks for watching. Bye.